Hey, good morning, everybody. Happy Friday. Good morning, Julie, Carlos, Vin, JW, Mai, and Brian. Good morning, Ed. How are you? How's everybody doing? Happy Friday to everyone. Hope you've, hope you've all got uh, big plans this weekend. Good plans. Fun plans. Fun plans. Maybe that's what it is, fun plans. Um, all right, let's just jump in here, I guess. Um, so this morning I get up, I turn my computer on. The first thing I think to myself is, damn that T-line. Um, and then the second thing is I want to congratulate Steve B out there for buying some spy calls. Uh, he's got it right, a little bounce out here. There may be other people there. Steve just just made a little noise in the room and shouted that out yesterday. So congratulations, Steve B. Way to go. Okay, so with that, I mean, the the Bulls are still in charge. They were still in charge yesterday. I, I mentioned that. The trend is still up. Anytime we have a bullish or bearish trend, you're always going to have, you know, times of, of you know, pullbacks, um, things like that. But the overall trend stays intact. And that's so far what is happening. Here, um, the bulls are kind of waking up today. The big question is, can they take it higher? And, you know, we just have to follow the price action and follow the chart with that. With this. You do have a pretty good size bearish in golf here. It could be the bounce is very short-lived, and then we, we, we could just move sideways sloppy uh, until we want till the market wants to break out and move up. If we start breaking yesterday's low, that bearish engulf low, then that could put us down to some of those lower levels. So that's going to be pretty important to watch uh, right through there. Okay, I've got. Um, Four charts, four targets. Is it four? One, two, three, four. Yeah, four charts, four targets. Uh, and let's look at. Uh, let's start with uh, TG. Now, this is. These are all longs, so it's all based on the market continuing uh, its bullishness. So, four charts, four targets. Now, let, let's think about this. Um, we're 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 moving up. You can see that. We're moving up. That doesn't mean that there can't be sloppiness, just like I mentioned that in the uh, spy there. We could pull back. These are what I see as targets moving up, and that's based on bullishness. If we if we fail, we might fail a little bit. That that's a scenario. We fail a little bit, and then we come back up. That's that's the normal movement of a chart. A chart doesn't move. Let, let's say. Our target here is 140, okay? That doesn't mean the chart's going to go to 140. That means the chart's going to do what the chart does. It breathes in, out. It drops into potholes. It it weathers storms. Um, it, it, it's got to, you know, work through it, so keep that in mind. But right now, target, I'm looking at targets of about 138.20. We'll just round that to 140. Let's round that up to 142 up there on target. The next one's going to be car. Again, if you just look at that trend right there, the trend tells the story. There's the trend. Now let's look at what happens in a trend. We have rallies, we have rest, rallies, rest, rallies, rest, rallies, rest, rally, rest, rally, rest. Nothing's going to change. Just because the next target up here is 5870, it doesn't mean that we can't rest before we rally. Okay, entry, we, we like to entry in this area right in here. This would be a good area for me to enter in. Enter in. I'll even go up a little bit. So around this area in here, looking for 5870, uh, 60, 50, and 62 and a quarter for a target. Um, CVS, CVS has started its move up. Nice rounded bottom breakout. Targets 7640, 7780, 7920, 8060 up there. To go from here to here, we're going to need something to kick it off. 
And there's no way you can get to those numbers up there unless we get through that number right there, that 7640. So what we're going to watch for is that bullish candle that it, it, it could start today. It could close bullish today and then we have follow through Monday, something like that. It could just trek along here for the next several days, even pull back to set up better and then move. Once it does, we'll start looking at 7780, 7920, 8060 up there. Remember with those pullbacks. Um, Zion. Zion is another one moving up here with targets of about 41, 4275, 4470. You've got the 200 period moving average right there. That's going to be something we need to break out of. So this, it, we may not be set up right there in that area for a buy. What might need to happen is move sideways, maybe even a little bit of a pullback. We've got a bit of a gap here that could get filled. Once it gains its composure, then we can start looking at those targets up there like that. So there's four charts, uh, four targets. And yes, Barry, uh, CVS's uh, earnings on Wednesday. Thanks for sharing uh, on that. So yeah, always watch the earnings. Let's take a look. Since we have time, let's take a look at a couple other charts. Let's take BIDU here. BIDU is setting up quite nice. If you look at this, this whole thing right through here is nothing but consolidation. Just the back and forth, back and forth with price. You can see the trend indicator still remains uh, bullish, trending up. And now we're looking at breaking out right in here. So what we may look for is for BIDU to reach up to this 160 target in here. Um, BABA is one. Here's BABA where we've popped up, we flagged. Overall, the trend is very nice. Chart pattern looks good. Up, flagged, and now we're trying to break out. That puts the targets, uh, we'll put the high target in here. And when, I, and when I'm looking at these targets, this, it, I'm not saying it can't go higher. It could. I'm just looking for swing trader targets, trades to trade the swing. Um, let's come over here to this watch list. Uh, take a look at uh, CWEB breaking out here. CWEB, nice breakout. So here we've got a pop to the downside. We set up for an inverted head and shoulders here. Now the trade is on its way. Manage that trade. The next, the biggest target that I see up here right now is about 52.80 uh, up here on this high um, back in March. So uh, keep in mind, it can zigzag on the way up there, just like this. Up, zigzag, up, just like that. All right. I'll catch everybody at the bottom of the hour when the market opens up. Thanks so much for being here. Again, happy Friday, Friday to everybody. Take care. See you in about 30 minutes.